Hi. I got your profile for evaluation and this evaluation is going to be based on your Java coding skill. Specifically, I'm going to ask you a Java 8 program to write down. Okay. So you have a list of integers and you have to identify all the numbers from that list, which are going to start with one. Okay. So you can start writing the program. Okay. All right. Uh, so I have a list of uh, integer and I have to find all the numbers that start with one using Java 8 features. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to take a list of integer. I'm going to name it as uh, numbers and I'm going to add some values to this list using arrays dot uh, as list. So we have this method arrays dot as list and I'm going to add some uh, numbers 10, 12, uh, 50, 30, 18 and one more 19. Okay. So I have this list populated. Now I'm going to use Java 8 features to perform this operation. Uh, for uh, from numbers, I'm going to get the streams. So stream is the first step. And then I want to find all the numbers that start with one. So here I have 10, 12 and 18 and 19. So these four numbers are starting with one. The first step is I'm going to use a map function and it, using map function, I'm going to uh, convert all the numbers uh, to its string representation. So to convert uh, to its string representation, I'm going to concat an empty string to all the numbers. So that is the first step. Uh, the next step is to uh, filter. So I'm going to filter the number that starts with one. So I'm going to use uh, something called a starts with. So S and uh, I'm going to use starts with starts with the uh, checks if the if your string starts with a specific character so I'm going to pass a specific character which is in our case one and after a uh, filter I'm going to uh, print all the numbers uh, from the filtered list for this I'm going to use for each and within for each I'm going to pass uh, system dot out and I'm going to use method reference, uh, which is a feature of uh, Java 8. And I'm going to pass uh, the method name, which I want to use. So I'm going to use print ln. So print ln is going to be my uh, method. So here, what I have done, I have extracted the stream. I have uh, for each element in the list, I have concatenated it with uh, an empty string. So integer is converted to your string representation. Then I used filter. Uh, and the numbers that starts with one. So let me run this. Okay, so when I run this, I get uh, all the numbers that starts with uh, uh, one. Okay, perfect. I have another program. Can you try to reverse a number? You can use JDK 8 or JDK 7, whatever you want, but I have a number and I wanted to num uh, reverse that number. So can you write another program? Okay, so to reverse the number, uh, there is an integer number, correct? Yes, correct. So I'm going to use uh, integer uh, number is going to be, I'm going to use uh, any random number, 5672, for example. And uh, I'm going to uh, declare one more variable known as uh, reverse. So this variable will hold the reversed integer number uh, after the logic ends. Uh, I'm going to use a while loop for performing this uh, operation and uh, until number is uh, not equal to zero, I'm going to perform my uh, logic. So I'm going to iterate through the number until it is uh, not equal to uh, zero. In the logic, what I'm going to do, I'm going to target this digit first, uh, which is two. So to get that uh, digit, I'm going to use uh, integer. Uh, remainder and I'm going to uh, divide the number or mod mod the number by 10. So I'm going to modulus the number by 10. So after doing module module modulus operator, I'll get this digit, which is two. So after that, I'm going to uh, form my reverse number to form the reverse number. Uh, I'm going to use uh, reverse into 10. So whatever is the previous value of reverse, I'm going to multiply that by 10 and I'm going to add the remainder. So this is going to give me uh, the reverse number. And also I'm going to divide my number uh, by 10. So number is equal to number 
divided by 10. So after this operation, number divided by 10, uh, my the left over number will be 5, 6, 7. And then uh, in the next iteration, I will target uh, the next digit, which is 7. So after the while loop, when I print uh, the output using south, the output will be in the reverse uh, data uh, so reverse variable. So let's try to uh, run this program. Okay, so you can see it is uh, two seven six five reverse of your um, existing number. This is how I can okay. reverse it. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye.